Hey everyone, I hope you're doing well. Now today I want to talk about how to improve in Apex Legends. This video was kind of inspired after my recent video where I looked at my first hour of Apex versus my 2400 hour and everything in between. And I noticed after about the 1000 hour mark, I started to kind of become a little sloppy and actually became worse at the game. And now I know why and I know a way to fix it. And if you are a player that feels like they are not at their peak or they've hit a plateau in terms of their performance, then this video is going to help. Now, before we get into it, I would say this video may not help new players. If you're new, then you should try to focus on improving your aim, your positioning in fights, and your movement skills. Focus on those three things, and over time, you'll get better. And I'd say once you've hit about 500 hours in game, come and watch this video again. So, with that in mind, let's talk about the five words that can instantly improve your gameplay. And I'm not even kidding. Those five words are, am I doing something wrong? You just need to keep saying those words in your head almost constantly whilst you're playing. Whilst you're looting, am I doing something wrong? Am I staying still? Am I not picking up the items? When you're pushing a fight, am I doing something wrong? Are you taking the right angles? Are you going from cover to cover? Does it make sense to push right now? When you're aiming, am I doing something wrong? Are you clutched up? Are you really tense? Are you focused? When you're moving around the map, am I doing something wrong? Are you with your teammates? Are your teammates in a fight somewhere else? Are they healing? This kind of little five word sentence is a constant check to constantly look at your surroundings look at what's going on in game get some contextual information and adjust yourself and check because chances are you know what's right and wrong you just don't really adhere to your own advice when you're in the middle of a fight because you panic or forget how to play properly so i'd say if you already know about positioning aim general movement then what you need to do is use this so every time you get into a fight Am I doing something wrong? Now, this gameplay here, I decided, look, I gotta find some way to make sure I'm still playing well, and this was it. So hopefully this video will help. Go jump into your games and try this yourself. Every time you are doing something, just constantly ask yourself that question. Am I doing something wrong? Am I doing something wrong? If you don't know if you are doing something wrong, then maybe you just need to improve your general skills, and that is something that will come with time. I'd say play yourself a lot, watch high level players, and over time, you'll be able to know what's right or wrong, and all you have to do is just listen to your own advice, and you'll be good to go. This is sort of like a tip towards myself, and I guess in a way that kind of works really well for me. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Let's jump into the gameplay where I put this strategy in action. Okay, so the first thing I guess is wrong is like, I don't want to hot drop, right? I shouldn't hot drop all the time. It's usually what gets me killed when I'm playing good. pubs, because I mean, well, you just want to have fun, but I don't really want to hot drop. I want to land somewhere where I'm going to at least get a couple weapons first. There's a bunch of people landing near us. This is, yeah, but obviously that's the hot drop. The We're gonna land here. So, let's check. We, our teammate's going that way, so we need to not lose track of where our teammate is going. Which is something I do a lot, actually. I'm gonna drop that, go for that. Right, our teammate's already on a fight, I think. No, no, we're good. Okay. Let's try and get some information here without too much. So there's people over there. There's people right here. I'm doing something wrong, actually. I'm like way exposed to that side. I shouldn't have done that. Like I should always try and focus on having cover on me, right? My teammates far to my left. They're pushing me on my own. I need to get to my teammate. Right? There's no point just running into a fight on my own. As much as that is, you know, I feel confident to do that. Let's not. Let's not ever extend. Now we got our teammate to back us up, so we can do this. As a squad. There we go. Alright, before we loot, let's just have a quick look, make sure no one's around. Okay, great. Are we doing anything wrong? Is there any loot that we've missed? No, we don't want an optic on our Mastiff. So now we're good. I, I already made two mistakes. Uh, I mean, one was I peeked up there without any cover. Yes, I got the kill, but I could have at least done it from within cover, right? Another mistake I made is that I pushed a little bit. And I didn't have my teammate there, but I corrected myself. So, you know, all I'm doing is just saying, am I doing something wrong, right? Am I doing something wrong right now? Um, oh, oh, now I'm doing something wrong. <laughs> Did not mean to click that. 
One thing I think we could just have a quick peek down here to see if there's anyone there. Um, looks like Cossack wants to go this way. There's obviously people been here. We'll right, we've looked at the map. That's one thing we got to check on is the rings. Okay. Let's go here. Enemy here. Right, I want to push this fight. Let's see if this Cossack will come. You know, if I go alone, then I'm just being a bad teammate, so I should stick with him. Maybe he needs some loot that he doesn't have yet, so, you know. We've got a long I gotta, to I gotta go think like that. Do Am I doing something wrong? Obviously, okay, so here's like a way to look at it. I want to fight. Usually I'd be like, come on, what are you doing? I want to fight, but we don't really know. Is there anything you need? Right? If we can help him find it, then we can get into fight sooner. It's just like a different different way to look at things, I guess. Okay, so in this time, let's think, uh, may as well, do we need anything? We need shields, there we go, uh, I, <laughs> am I doing anything wrong? I don't have any shields. In normal cases, I would just be running off to fight right now, and I'd have no shields because I just want to get into a fight, but that's, that personally is my main issue. I, I don't, I've played so much that I don't really like looting, I can't be bothered to even focus on it. So there you go, a strategy is always ha already helping me. Right, uh, am I doing something wrong? Yes, I have way too many syringes. I don't need that many syringes. I may as well ping them for caustic first. Because he needs some. Right, let's not just run straight into that. Let's first figure out where people actually are. Okay, there's a res happening, like right here. Our squad got it. So another squad. I think they were the squad that won. So, let's see, what do we want? We want armor and shield. So there's better armor. Uh, we really want shield bats. There we go, shield bats. Let's drop some syringes. We don't need that many syringes. Oh, we still need to move. As you can see, like, you know, there's so many micro mistakes, especially with something like looting, you know, which actually does matter in the grand scheme of things, because Especially if you're playing ranked, and you're late game, you don't have enough meds or ammo. Um, you know, that's something I noticed too. I'm constantly asking my teammates for ammo. I guess it's a little harder, because I'm streaming, I'm trying to interact with my chat. But, I can still stop myself and ask, like, what am I doing right? What am I doing wrong? Regardless of whether this player is the best in the world or not. Me going in alone is silly. A lot of the times, I'm just pushing for kills, I want to get high kill games. Because that's the thing, you get into that that habit where you've played the game so much that nothing else really seems to matter to you. But instead of that, let's focus let's on trying ahead. to actually be better at the game. So I'm sort of talking to myself here, but I think that a lot of long-term players like me will benefit from this too. I bet we'll find something good here. All right, we know there's a fight, so let's think about here. Am I doing the right thing here? I think so. I think what we're going to do... Let's peek on the roof, have a little look to see if anyone's in there. And if not, then we can go inside the building, right? Right, am I doing something wrong? Um, okay, so there's a fight right here. Right, I'm being aggressive right now. Let's think, where's my teammate? Okay, he's here. So we're alright. Yeah, let's go, let's do this. Got a teammate, let's not chase down kills. Okay. Chill up. There's loads of his gas everywhere, so we should be good to do this. Now let's heal up before we push that Bangalore, you know? It's time to do it. Is there anything we need right now? Not really, I think we're good. Let's try and get out of the gas so we can actually see what's going on a bit. Why is Claire pushing me here? Alright, get inside because they're both pushing hard. Let's armor swap. Shoot that gas trap so that we have a bit of space from them. Alright, we've played that corner well, right? Played the cover well. Am I doing anything wrong? No? Okay, yeah. Maybe overextended there. Let's armor swap again. That's my old armor. Okay, I need to heal. 
We really need to heal. But uh, for some reason I thought I was playing cost. It's my bad. We should heal. Let them fight, right? Oh, we need to step outside, otherwise we're gonna get shot here. Hold this corner. Up here. Cover, cover. Oh, there we go. Right? We did something wrong there. We went behind cover. I mean, we didn't go behind cover. We could have gone behind cover. Okay, so we've got another squad here. We need to focus. What are we doing wrong? Do I want to be using a hemlock at this stage in the game? No, no, you take it, man. You take it. Uh, am I doing something right? They want to push this. They want to push this. So. They're coming around this side. They're going to push through. I do have a digital front. I'm going to put down my ult to see if I can get a digital front. That would be big. Right, there's obviously someone right on that door. There's a digital front. There we go. Right, play the angle, right? Don't stick out of this cover. We don't need to. She's backing out. Let's use this time to heal. Vision isn't great right now, but as long as we stay in cover, we should be good. Alright, there's a player here on her own. I have the cost there. Alright, there we go. 1v2, 1v2. Heal up, heal up. You don't need to push this. Let's heal, let's heal. Okay, I'm gonna make sure a little harder. Oh, this angle is fine. Right. Hip fire, hip fire. Oh, ADS. There we go, there we go, there we go. Right, we didn't have to panic, right? We had that. GG, GG. <laughs> Good teamwork, man. Good teamwork. See? Oh my goodness. It's so much easier if you just talk yourself through the process. Ask yourself, are you doing anything wrong? There you go. You are there the is improved, champions. right? We calmed ourselves down, we looked at the situation, and we got a win, right? I mean, there we go. I think that we did well. If we do that every single day, the amount of minute, like, changes you're going to make in your brain to become a better player are really going to add up. So, yeah, if you've reached a point where you don't know how to improve, try this. Really do. Try it. Give it a go. Thank you all for watching. I hope to see you all in the comments. I really do appreciate all your support. I'll see you there. Cheerio. Did you know I stream almost every day from 7 p.m. UK time or 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time? You can catch me live right here on YouTube, so make sure you have notifications turned on. I also have a new members program. Become a member for $2.99 a month, get your comments highlighted in videos, get a cool badge in live stream chat, get access to these cute emotes, and also gain access to my members tips videos, where you can ask me for any tips and I'll be making new videos weekly to help you improve your own game. Click the join button or click the link in the video description to get involved.